Hi and welcome back to my channel. I am the Bibliophile Puzzler. My name is Robin and I am going to spin the wheel but I just wanted to tell you a little bit about what's going on. I've done six puzzles this month so far. I have one started on my puzzle table but I'm also diamond painting in the mornings and still working a lot on my blog. Also, I started a new medication and it's given me really bad fatigue, which I was warned of. So I'm going to spin the wheel so that I can find a puzzle that I can work on in bed. And so that's what we're doing right now. Okay, this Copenhagen puzzle is a... Um, an Ibu puzzle. I had to think about it for a second because last month I did a puzzle called Copenhagen, but it was a Buffalo Games puzzle that was 750 pieces. This Copenhagen puzzle by Ibu is, I'm pretty sure, 1,000 pieces. It's square, and I'm going to get my tray out and start sorting it. So thank you so much for watching, and before I end this clip, I will hide the slice. Okay, I made that clip about two weeks ago. I just kind of fell off the map. So I've really slowed this part of the uh, slideshow down to kind of explain to you what happened to me, where I've been, and why I never uploaded this puzzle finish. Now, this again is a square 1000 piece Ibu jigsaw puzzle. It was coming along really well. But I left, or kept, I should say, the tray on my bed. My husband works at night, so there was no problem there. And at some point during the night, I bumped the tray and knocked it over. And I was not able to retrieve all of the pieces. So right here, where you see in the clip, is where I was before I knocked the puzzle over. So then, what you see here is the mess after all the pieces that I was able to retrieve were picked up. So I started to put everything back in the box and just say forget it. But no, I went ahead and did my best to resort it and to try to assemble it. Now... I love this puzzle and I love the Ibu brand, so I will be purchasing another one of these because after I was able to put it together, I think I was missing five pieces in the end. What you're looking at right here is when I got back to almost where I was before I knocked the tray over. The other part of the thing that I wanted to mention in this video is my reluctance to upload is partly due to that medication I mentioned that has got me in a tizzy as far as fatigue is concerned, but also because I have been spending my morning's diamond painting and working on my blog as I finish each book. I think to this point I have read 40 or 41 books so far during the month of, um, no, I think I've read 44 books so far this month of February. So every book that I read, of course, I need to write the review, post it, and cross post it. And that all takes time. So a lot of you have been messaging me and saying that I am being missed. So I'm just going to go with it from here. I'm not even going to read the poem. I'm just going to upload this video and say that I am working on a Charles Wysocki puzzle that I probably will finish tonight. So you'll see another upload tomorrow. But bear with me. I'm going through a lot. I've got some stuff coming up in the near future that's not pleasant. And it's really taking a toll on my mentality. But thank you so much for watching. And for those of you who have inquired about me being missing, I appreciate you. Have a good one. Bye-bye.